Tired from all that playing? Well, I don't know. How do you get so tired from doing all that nothing? Ha ha ha. That's very funny, Montana. I still play sometimes. The hell are you talking about? What you play and what I play are not the same. Yeah, and I'm sure Jimi Hendrix and your pretty boy, Miles Davis, have the same dealer. These prep school fuckers make you forget what music really is. And what exactly is that, Jonah? Well, it's certainly not this circus you're a part of and the clothes they make you wear. Jesus! <laughs> Oh, trying to take us off the road there, buddy, eh? Ooh, my little pretty one, my pretty one. When you gonna give me some time, Sharona? See, this, this is what music's all about. On Sunday, all I'm playing at the party is my type of music. Wait, what party? You are coming to the party on Sunday, right? One last bang before I go away. You idiot! What? Community College is actually a really respectable place. Plus, Rain is gonna be a demon on the kit, and I am going to absolutely shred on guitar. It should be a fun time of a turn. Will you calm your kids? They're sagging right now. I know another way. Hey, so me and the guys you can go head down to the river after and you can come if you want, but now that I think of it, you'll probably be too busy kissing ass. I'll be there around 2.30, but don't wait up for me. Oh, come on, dude. You never flake on the guys. These prep school pricks have changed you. Still got a bottle of Fireball on you? <laughs> of course I do. Never leave home without it. 2.30. Don't be late. And don't you dare accuse me of flaking on the guys again. Bitch, you flake more than dandruff, you stupid, smelly, rat mother- You get these back when you deserve them, Red Eye. Okay, listen, I haven't smoked in about three days. That feels like a new record, so I think I deserve okay, a round of applause. You say, whatever you well, say. you better get to it, because those privileged assholes aren't going to screw each other without you. No way. The Nora Bosley's working today? It's, uh, my pleasure. Nice to see you too, Montana. Why, you're not excited to see me anymore? Oh, I see what's going on. You're at 
talented artist that's too captivated by her canvas to notice the real model in front of her. Well, I never said that. What are you working on anyway? Is that... is that us? No, no, it, uh... Are you sure? It really looks like you and me. Just some original characters I'm working on. Well, that sucks, because they look really cute together. Where is he? He's 12 minutes late, again! His stoner friend's probably taking his sweet-ass time getting him here. Oh, Jonah. Yeah, that dude's fucked. Well, that's a pretty strong word, but he's, he's fucked. fucked. This is unbelievable. You know what? Nora has his number. We'll just get her to call him for us. He's fucked. Hey, Nora, can you call Montana? Having fun, you two? Honey, sorry I'm late, but traffic was just crazy today. How nice of you to finally show up to disrupt Nora instead of doing what you're here to do! Oh, please, me being late isn't gonna make you guys play any worse than you usually do. Oh, so you think it's funny to always show up late and then I'm playing like shit! Alright everyone, Chameleon. Let's see if Montana still has it in to keep up with us. on those first few bars. Maybe try practicing for once. Fuck. You got a problem? You know what, guys? Uh, I'm just not feeling it today. You guys want to call it a day? You know, just like, call it off, you know? We absolutely will not. We called you here. You're on my clock. Maybe try getting your head out of your ass and doing what we brought you here to do, which is playing the bass and playing it well. Actually, Vance, you're on my time. And I don't like being patronized when I'm the one doing a favor for you. I'm the leader. I'm just trying to show the weaker links the ropes. Hey, what are you doing? You told me to get my head out of my ass. Once I leave this fucking place, I might actually be able to. What does that even mean? It means you're an asshole, Vance, in case you didn't already know. Oh, what? Did I teach the leader something? You can't bail on us now. Sunday's the jazz gal. We can't find a replacement in that short a time. Find someone to play on this, Vance. I was fucked. Vance is a real hothead, huh? You don't say. God, I hate that guy. I take it you're not coming Sunday? <laughs> well, Kansas is one of my biggest fan now, can I? Oh, so you noticed that. <laughs> of course I noticed. 
I also noticed that without me, those guys are gonna eat total shit. But uh, if I do show up, it'll be for you. Oh, Montana. Bye. Still got that bottle of fireball on you. <laughs> <laughs> so she's on bottom, and I'm on top, pushing her legs pretty much all the way behind her head. Dude, this chick was a dancer. Dancer chicks are the most flexible girls you'll ever meet! Oh my god! Dancer girls are the most flexible girls I'll ever meet. Okay? The whole truck ride here. That's all you've talked about. Okay? Can you just talk about something that's not that? Like anything. Like I'm cool with anything. Like we could talk about bushes for all I care. Just not that. Alright, you big pussy. Ah, see what I did there? Yeah. Probably a tight one too. Shut up. I may as well catch you up on the guys. Rain's a big guy now, by the way. Oh, yeah. Solid. It's like the Berlin Wall. And Maddox, God bless him, he's almost as smart as it. Glad to see you've been cutting back. Uh. Woo! Well, what a great conversation as always. What's good with you, Montana? Good isn't the right word. Bored. No, that's exactly how I feel. You're 16. How can you be bored? Shouldn't you be out playing, like, traffic and shit? Easy for you to say. Get hauled back into a squad car lately? Come and find out. Oh, oh. Fight, fight, fight! Oh, you want some too? What the f- Ugh! 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 Move your meat, lose your seat, bitch! Ugh! Why so angry, Ugh. Rain? Ugh. Want me to kick you out again? Ugh! 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 Not angry, just... Tired as hell. But clearly not as tired as Sleeping Beauty over there. Not tired, just burnt out. Ah, you got some somebody. You've been paying houses again? Nah, haven't you heard? Jonah's a college man now. Oh, I heard. That party's still going down Sunday? Still going down. Are we still playing a set? Nothing's changed, man. Quit asking. But we still have no one on base. Montana plays a bit. Oh, he does. What do you say, hot stuff? Want to jump with the big boys? Well, that depends. What do you guys play? What do you mean, what do we play? You know what music is? We play that. I knew that, but what kind of music? We've got our own stuff ready to show off. You know Metallica? Yeah. Well, fuck those guys, man. We've got some way better, but we still have no one on base. Well, I'll uh, see if I can fit in my tight schedule, but um, if it's so good, then why don't you have a bassist already lined up? Well, we had someone, but she never worked out. I guess we just uh, drifted apart. Well, I don't know, Rain. It seemed to be going pretty well until you started showing up at her house all hours of the day. Oh yeah, and how would you know that? I was painting her house. Oh! Ho -ho. Well, uh, Rain, from now on, eyes are up here. <laughs> yeah, no shit. Thought your eyes were over there. who's graced us with his presence. I missed you too, baby. Let's go with you, Milo. Got about 45 new things. 45 caliber, polymer frame, packs one hell of a punch. Milo? Why the hell do you have a gun? It's under my uncle's name. Thought we could have some fun with it. 
All right, hot stuff. Let's see what you can do. Now? No, not now. Next Hanukkah. Of course now. Milo? What the hell do you think you're doing giving the kid a gun? You want to see what's new? Sure as hell is something notable. At least practice your gun safety. Make sure you use two hands. Eh, uh, what do you know about gun safety? Just watch and learn. All right. Just line that shit up with the sights and let it rip. Ah, damn amateur. Observe. Watch this, hot stuff. Oh, come on, Milo. This is stupid. Can you just- Man, someone's stupid if I miss. Bullseye. There, you got it. Now can you put that thing away? Well, you guys getting your action here? I'm gonna get some action on my own at Monica's house. Oh, you know all too well where that house That's is, right. don't you, buddy? Hey, just make sure the paint's not still wet, hey? Fuck <laughs> off. Montana, if you're still in, 9 o'clock tomorrow morning. Yeah, whatever, I'll think about it. Is that everyone? Where's Alice? Who's Alice? Oh, you don't know her yet, but uh, Milo does. Milo can tell you all about her, and all about how he thinks she wants to rip his clothes off. Is that right? I'll rip your tongue off. <laughs> Well, aren't you quite the character? I'm just bugging you, my little baby. And that's everyone. We got Pepsi over there in the coolest. Pepsi? I thought you'd have something a little stiffer. Gotta stay sober when you're around. Wouldn't want to make any bad decisions. Oh, well, you wouldn't be one of them. Ah! Maddox! Shut up! Who's the new kid? Oh, this? This is Montana. Doesn't hang out with us much on account of him being one of them Maynard dorks. And on account of you never leaving. Oh, damn. All right, Montana, two beers, please. Yeah, no problem. Jesus. Thanks, kid. Do I know you from somewhere? You ever seen a show on Maynard? I'm the bassist. Maynard. Oh, you mean those pretentious jazz people? Yeah, I've been there once. They think they're better than everyone else. Well, I won't argue with you there. Some of them can certainly come off like that, but you know, there's some nice people there too. It's not all bad. Right, so which one are you? Thanks, well, man. Well, it's, I mean, in, in standing with the other guys, I mean, I guess I'm pretty nice. I mean, compared to Vance, anybody's nice, but you know, I, I personally like to think of myself as pretty nice, but I, I'm actually not too, you know, cookie, I, I, um, uh, <laughs> Uh, Not anymore, bitch. Ah, uh, fuck you, Milo. It still counts as a touchdown. Ah! Uh! So, uh, why'd you want to come on this walk, anyways? Because it's beautiful out. Look at the sky. Why? Did you want to leave? Uh, no, I just uh think it's nice out here. Oh, it's because it's you and me alone. What? No, I was just... Uh, sorry. I'm kidding. Lighten up.
I'm getting too old for this shit. Lethal Weapon reference? Terrible movie in my opinion, but... Do go on. What shit? Milo and all his drama. He still thinks I'm into him. Don't get me started on that guy. I despise him. You know, he's had the hots for me since we first met. I like to toy around with him a little bit. I think he's gonna get some, but he's nothing but a punk with too much anger. Thank you! Thought I was the only one. Well, you're not. Everyone in this town wears a mask. A mask? Yeah, a mask. Fake personality. Wow, you're, you're dark. <laughs> now you're starting to sound like Milo. Good God, no. Well, that is pretty deep, though. Not really. It's just an observation. Plus, you're the preppy guy. Don't you think of deeper shit all the time? No, not really. Everyone thinks that just because I go to Maynard, I'm some sort of genius, but I'm not. The only reason I get in is because, you know, I play bass for their jazz band. I mean, I'm the best in town. Literally. The best bass player in all of Bridgeland. Now, well, don't get too cocky. This town isn't that big. Are you going to the party on Sunday? Yeah, I'm thinking about it. Well, Rain's looking for a bassist for his punk rock band. If you're that good, I think you should join. Yeah, I don't know about that one. You brought it up with me before, but I don't know. Montana, give it a chance. Plus, I heard chicks dig musicians. You know what? Maybe. If uh, they bring it up again, I'll, uh, I'll consider it. Damn right you will! Where the hell have you been? Everybody else, vamoose, gone. Went to the store for some milk like my dad. I was right about to leave without you. What happened? I don't know. I, uh, guess I lost track of time. No shit. Alice, you need a ride home? No, I'm okay. I'm sure I'll see you guys around soon. Awesome. You coming to the party on Sunday? Yeah, I heard Montana's playing as well. Oh, he is, is he? See, I told you, if she's telling you to do it, you gotta do no, it. No, I know, I know. Just, I'll talk to you about this in the truck. <laughs> yeah, see you awesome. Around. Bye, baby. Montana. You gonna be okay to drive later, man? Oh, uh. Lover boy, what's oh this I God. hear about you playing in the band? Okay, look. She asked me to join, so I I think I'm gonna join. Awesome! <laughs> Rain, Rain is gonna be so fucking hype! <laughs> You're playing the band! J Jonah, are you? Are you drunk? Are you gonna be okay? I'm not drunk. I'm Jonah Nystrom, and I've got a nice bomb. Yeah, look at it, look at it! to show up. Who designed your outfit? Drop in center? So, uh, what are we playing today, guys? Well, got nothing set in stone. We're just jamming out. We play real heartfelt music here. Not that soulless jazz shit. Well, uh, where do you guys want to start? Well, we're not quite sure, but, uh... Oh, Maddox, you, you had an idea, right? Maddox, you, uh, you play? I play the sticks. The sticks? But you were on drums, Rain. We made an exception. He's a peculiar little guy, but he's destined for great things. One day he's gonna own and operate his own cave. <laughs> well, uh, can you say you do much better here, Rain? Have you heard me play? Watch this. Oh shit, are we playing? Wait, no, no, hey. St. Jimmy's coming down across the alleyway! Guys! Up on the boulevard, Guys. like a gun on for Guys! What exactly are we doing here, okay? We're playing. Have you ever been in a real band? Have you? Okay, Montana, can I talk to you for a second? Listen, just 
lay off the guy, okay? Look, I don't know if you noticed, but we practice a little bit differently than you and the Maynard Prince. Yeah, I can tell. We, we just run our own operation here, okay? So do you get how we run things here? Unfortunately, I think I do. I'm assuming we don't use sheet music or anything conventional like that. Fuck that sheet music shit! That's like another language! It is another language! It's literally- Alright. Alright. You know what? I'll back off because you know what? This is your band and I hate to act stuck up. Well, I expect nothing less. Look, man. This shit we do here, it's not like that preppy jazz stuff you're used to. This is music that comes from the heart. It's real. It's raw. It's really what music's all about. Now it's your turn, hot stuff. They say you're the best bassist in Bridgeland, so let's put that to the test. Play something. Well, what do you want to hear? You already failed the test, man. Why'd you even come out here today? Huh. Well, you gonna let him talk to you like that, kid? Nope. Good. Shit. Fuck, dude. Ha <laughs> I told you he was good. Come on, shake your body, baby, do that conga. I know you can't control yourself any longer. Come on, shake your body, baby, do that conga. I know you can't control yourself any longer. All right, David. Now, doesn't that look so much better? Now that we added some texture, clean up the sideburns. I wish I could tell, but I can't, because I'm blind! It sounds a little long. It's your life, baby! I'm just trying to keep you looking fabulous! Don't tell me where you're going on this. Bye, David! <laughs> Stay cute! He may be the blind one, but come on! He was a disaster before picking some monstrosity of my hairdo. Like, after seeing that, I wish I was the blind one. <laughs> I missed you too, Andre. Aww. You know I always miss you. I mean, how can I not with a face like that? <laughs> you never change. No. Wait. Big red cheeks, a calm face, and a smile that makes you look like a kid again. <gasps> Don't tell me. Ah! You met someone. <laughs> this is so exciting. I did not meet anyone. And if I did, you of all people would know that I'd be out there getting as much action as humanly possible. No, 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 I know that face. Montana Rooney loses in love! So, where did you meet her? At a rock concert, band practice... The river of all places. I knew it, you do have a heart. So, what's her name? Alice. Alice Asher. She's nothing like anybody I've ever met before. There's a lot you haven't seen, baby, and trust me, you do not want to see everything. And lots of regret in she photos. She's different, you know? She she carries herself like one of the guys, but she's the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. Then go for her, baby! She's probably drooling all over you right now as we speak. Well, actually, that's what I came down here to talk to you about. How the hell do I know if she's actually interested in me? <sighs> you don't. You, you need to show her that you are the real deal. The big, sexy hunk that you are. And if she's interested, she'll 
Fargo. She was flirting. At least I, I think she was. But Demo, why is it so hard to tell? Uh, you're overthinking. Any sexy babe stupid enough to live in this dump of a city would be lucky enough to have those musical hands of yours make some magic of their own. I just need to know that what happened wasn't a fluke. You know, for all I know, I'll never see her come my way again. If she's interested, she'll follow. Um, I'm getting too old for this shit. Lethal Weapon reference? Thought you hated that movie. Yeah, I gave it a second chance. You know, Gibson and Glover have some great chemistry. Oh, so now you're a film critic? Bravo! I'm not a film critic, I just know good chemistry when I see it. Oh, chemistry! So you're a science teacher. Well, uh, the kind of chemistry I like is the kind where the final reaction is me asking you out. Oh! <laughs> that was bad. That was bad! The chemistry pickup line? Ugh, well, I gotta hand it to you. You said it. So, uh, what do you say? We're putting Jaws back in theater till Monday. Sure. Because you're scared to go alone? What? No, I love that stuff. You know, big ass sharks, blood and guts, what could be better? Well, me coming with, obviously. Obviously? I mean, uh, if you ain't got nothing better to do, I mean, you can take along if you want. Nope. Here is my address. How does 3.30 sound? Sounds like a plan. As long as you don't show up as slow as you can run. I've seen everything, baby, and you definitely want a piece of that. got me driving without a license just so you can drive me crazy with your fashion choices. What's wrong with it? Dude, you look like a nerd. This chick is a bad bitch. Alright, you need some edge. Lay off, man. I'm dressed fine. Are you sure? I'm kind of a fashionista myself, so for a pretty little boy like you, you can stop by my place and get a dress. No, no, no. Seriously, it's no big deal if you want to stop by my place. I said no, okay? Damn, I'm just fine. Whatever. Nerd. What did you say? 
nerd. Say it one more time, bitch. Oh, with pleasure. <clears throat> Montana Marino is a fucking nerd! <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> fucking stupid? <laughs> a little bit, yeah. Oh, I'll lighten up, dude. I'm just teasing you. Alice is a cool chick. If she hasn't chopped your nuts off by now, you're basically home free. This one. Nice park drop. Thanks. Taught myself. Yeah, I can sell. Hey, lover boy. Where the hell are you going? No, 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 no. A gift from God. The hell is this? Look, man, I can't watch you kill yourself like this, okay? It would be immoral. Plus, I'm the bomber here. Put it on. Dude, if I put this on, I'm gonna look like one of the fucking village people, all right? <sighs> right now? Yeah, you look like one of the fucking village people. You put that on, boom, boom, boom! You're a straight up sex pistol, blasting all over their faces. Put it on. All right. It's a little tight. Now that, that is badass. That has edge. And that, my friend, is how you're gonna get laid tonight. That's so. Go get her, nerd. Oh, fuck you. Can I help you, shitface? Yeah, is this the right address? 61 Goldridge Drive? Yeah, that's right. What's up? Is, uh, is Alice around? Alice, some guy's out here looking for you. Thanks. So, uh, it's a real nice place you got here. It's a real, uh, nice part of town, nice neighborhood. Listen, you... kid, I know what your game is. You're like every other bonehead teenager coming around here trying to take Alice out. You're a punk. Listen closely. You hurt my daughter, I'm gonna hurt you. And I'm gonna hurt you a lot more than that leather jacket's gonna cover up. You got it? You got it? Whatever you say, shitface. Hey, you two gonna need a ride after? I have a couple errands to run through, but I can come get you afterwards. Nah, I think we're okay. We'll, uh, we'll catch a cab or something. Thanks anyways, though. Oh, yeah, and by the way, I'm staying over at Milo's tonight. I just want to make sure he doesn't go over the deep end. I hope he did. I hate that guy. You know I do. Yeah, man. I know. Trust me. We all know. Anyways, you should get going. And remember... Don't stress out. You got this, man. Don't worry, I won't. All right.
up on the big screen. I thought you said you weren't scared of Jaws. Never said I was scared. Practically grew up watching that movie. Maybe that's why you're so messed up. Oh, so now you can touch my arm, but in the theater you were pissing your pants? Oh, come on. You saw that? Of course I did, you dumbass. Well, that's my cue to leave. You know, it was nice on you and I had a really good time and then, oh! Can't leave that easy. Purple. It's a nice color, but it doesn't really go with the outfit, don't you think? Wow. We got a film critic, a fashionista, and a scientist. I got my hands full. Yeah, right. Plus, you still have to take me out for ice cream. Ice cream? Man, you really do know how to drain a guy's wallet. And his soul if he doesn't play his cards right. You're in public, Vance. Vance! What a horrible fucking surprise. Hello, Montana. Ooh, wanna introduce me to your lady friend? Back off. Alice. Who the hell are you? Alice. Now that's a beautiful name. I think I like you already. You're feisty. Do you have a last name? Or do you just go by Alice? Oh, is that how you get women to fall for you, Vance? That's your name, right? Vance? That it is. And you're somebody whose name I'd like to remember. Feel free to put anything on my tab. Like what you see? Not one bit. Montana, we need to talk. Tomorrow, are you in or out? What's tomorrow, Vance? I don't know. Does this ring any bells? Oh yeah, this. Last I checked, I was a weak player who wasted your time. Look, the past is the past. All I know is we were on top for four consecutive years. And without you, that would ruin our image. Is that something you want, Montana? It's what you want, but not what I want. I know you're bluffing. You'll be there. You're nothing without us. Nothing! Go find someone else, Vance. Hey! You're gonna pay for that chair. Put it on his tab. We're fucked. There was no easy way to bring it up. But that's fair, seeing as how much you have riding on it. As do I. He won't budge. We have no basis. Look. I've tried to convince him. He's just so stubborn. He needs, uh, he needs incentive. From you! Yeah. I've tried to play it nice, but there's just a line. A line that I won't cross. But you will. You're the Jesse Martinez. Bitch, I know who the fuck I am. But clearly you don't. See, I disagree. What about you, Spades? I strongly disagree. It ain't this little nigga Montana that need incentive. I think it's you, Vance. And the shit about you not crossing the line. You crossing the line today coming into my office telling me I'm about to lose a fat stack tomorrow? Because you and your boys can't figure out your shit and perform? Fuck out of here. What the fuck's wrong with you? Ah, I just still don't understand why you would put money on a charity jazz gala. You keep telling me how good you guys are, so why you worried? I bet on lots of shit. Mind your business. You fucking slow or something? Uh, all, I'm, all I'm saying is that he won't budge. So if you had any methods to bring him back to us, you won't lose any money. I promise you won't lose any money. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying, Jesse. So you asking me to fuck him up? You asking me, the Jesse Martinez, to fuck up some little last kid because he don't like you? Because you can't convince him to play bass for you? <laughs> <laughs> Bridgeline's a small ass town, Vance. You fuck up. Believe me. Ain't a single person that's gonna be as fucked as you. Off the halls of Tokyo, I'm down in London, town to go-go. Oh, if the records are 
reflection and a mirror's reflection. I'm a dancing all with myself. I when there's no one else inside. I think the crowd and lonely night. Well, I wait so long for my love vibration and I'm dancing all with myself. Well, well, well. But ain't the rock star himself, Jonah Neister. I was in the neighborhood. Thought I'd drop by. So, how exactly did you pay for a car like that? We're keeping it between you and me? I actually didn't pay for it. Yeah, I thought so. What? You telling me that ain't badass? The car? Yeah. You, on the other hand? Me what? Nothing, dude. Maybe just chill out a bit, okay? Oh, you came to chill out. You came to the right place. Uh, thanks, but no. Want something to eat? Jonah's got quite the collection. Um, not right now. Maybe a little later, though. Calm down, dude. What do you want? I need to talk to you, man. About? Look, we've been friends for a long time, man since, I don't know, probably the seventh grade. And look, I know you ain't had the easiest life, but dude, you've been up to some seriously dangerous shit lately. And uh, do you want me to show you around or? I mean, depends where. Listen, all I'm saying is that anybody can get in over their heads. And that includes you, Milo. I ain't in over my That's head. Life. Why do you even care? This doesn't affect you That's or any of the guys. Doesn't affect any of us, huh? Then what the hell was that shit you pulled at the river with Montana? What shit? You just show up with a gun and you think that's cool? Yeah, I thought we could have some fun with it. Milo, the kid is 16. He's never even been around a gun. That ain't fun to him. That ain't what normal people do. Listen, everybody hears your name, and they say, hey, you know Milo? That guy's fucked. Fuck you. Look, I'm just a messenger, man. I love you. Rain and the rest of the guys love you. But you're going to get us all in some deep shit that even you can't get us out of. Is everything okay? Or are you all right? I just had a fun date today, Montana. You know what? If you've got a bone to pick with Rain or the rest of the guys, go talk to them yourself. I came here to talk to my friend, but clearly, that guy just isn't here. All I see is some pothead criminal who's going nowhere but six feet under. Won't you put your money where your mouth is? Hit me in the fucking face, Jonah. You say I'm going six feet under? Send me there yourself! What happened? Montana was right. You are a joke. Helping Bridgeland wake up this morning, little Chrissy Hine and the Pretenders. 96.9, the wave. Remember, our request lines are open, wide open in the morning. Right after this, Michael Buble, Sway. 96.9, the wave. <laughs> i
and start to play Dance with me, make me sway Like a lazy ocean hugs the shore Hold me close, sway me more Like a flower bending in the breeze Bend with me, sway with ease When you dance you have to be with me Stay with me, sway with me Other dancers may be on the floor Dear, but my eyes will see only you Only you have that magic technique When we sway I go weak I can hear the sound of violins Long before it begins Make me thrill as only you know how Sway me smooth, sway me now Other dancers may be on the floor, dear, but my eyes will see only you. Only you have that magic technique. When we sway, I go weak. I can hear the sound of violins long before it begins. Make me feel as only you know how. Sway me smooth. Like a flower bending in the breeze Bend with me, swear with me When we dance you have a way with me Stay with me, swear with me When more we start to play Hold me close, make me sway Like a lotion of the shore Hold me close, swear me more So your lady friend really kept you up last night, eh? Guess you could say she did. That's my boy! I always knew you had it in you. So, tell me all about nah, it. Nah, don't worry about it. What went on with you and Milo last night? We came to an uneasy agreement that something's wrong with him. So, is he coming tonight, or is... I don't know, man. He's probably sleeping some shit off right now. I wouldn't count on it. Listen, shouldn't you be getting ready? Your lady friend said she's coming tonight. And, well, you don't want her to see you like that, or she might get cocky. She wants to go steady. I can tell. This girl's all over me, man, I tell ya. Poor girl. Well, anyway. That's enough out of me until I get a few shots in me. before I go away. Go have some fun, man. I sure am. All right. 
But anyways, we go back to Jonah's place. And it's, it's, it's totally black. It's, it's, it's totally black. And... Hey, you! Montana! Looking good, buddy! How's it going? Oh, sorry. sorry about that, man. Yeah. Are you okay to play later? Yeah, man, I'm psyched! Woo! Uh, did I do something to piss you off? No, don't be crazy. I was just talking to Sherwin about our date tomorrow. So, like, what well, we did yesterday. Listen, Montana. What we did yesterday meant nothing. I don't get it. I thought you liked me. I do, Montana. I like a lot of things right now, but being tied down to someone isn't one of them. I've got plenty of options. So that's all I was. An option. Shit, man, if I didn't stop to take a piss, those girls wouldn't let go of me. Doing alright, man? Seemed kind of in the dumps tonight. All I was was an option to her. A fucking option, Rain. What do you mean, man? Some broad lead you on again? Alice? Sheesh, man. Nothing much anybody can do about her. She's a free spirit. That's not true. There's just nothing I can do about it. So, look. So she takes you for a ride and then doesn't want a second turn? Look, man. Don't beat yourself up over it. On the bright side, look at this. There's lots of other sassy senoritas lurking around. Not like Alice. She was cool. Sassy and gorgeous. She was special. And I wasn't. Look, man, don't beat yourself up over it. Besides, it's time to play. Let's go. <clears throat> Alright, everybody. <clears throat> this song. Th this song. It's gonna be a special little shout out to our buddy Sherwin there. Because he gives all guys hope, and I'll tell you why. If he can get a girl with that haircut, there's hope for all of us. Anyways, we're gonna be playing a song called Saint Jimmy. So if you'll just hold your horses, I'm just gonna. Ah. Alrighty, let's go. St. Jimmy's coming down across the alleyway Up on a boulevard like a zip gun on parade Lights up a silhouette, he's insubordinate Coming at you on the count of one, two, one, two, three, four My name is Jimmy and you better not wear it out Suicide commando that your mama talked about King of the 40 Thieves, and I'm here to represent The needle in the vein of the establishment I'm the patron saint of the denial With an angel face and a taste for suicidal <laughs> Way outside, oh boy. A teenage assassin looking for some fun in the cult of the life of crime. Oh, I really hate to say it, but I told you so. So shut your mouth or I shoot you down, oh boy. Welcome to the club and give me some blood. I'm the resident leader of the lost and found. It's comedy and tragedy. It's Saint Jimmy, and that's my name. And don't worry about Montana. I heard you had some.
something you want to say about me. Thought you'd want to clarify before I knocked your teeth in. What'd you hear? Did you think I'm some sort of joke? Well, I don't see anyone laughing. Do you? Do you? All I hear is some degenerate barking about how someone hurt his feelings. Oh, so you did say it. Care to say anything else? No, not that I can think of. But what do I know? For all I know, I'll be dead the second you pull that gun of yours on me. Montana, what are you doing? It's gonna kill you! No, he won't, and you wanna know why? Because you're weak. You're all talk, no walk. You hide behind a gun. Alright. I'm not even scared of you anymore. Nobody is. Everyone knows you're Saphoni. You wanna be some thug? Some soulless fucking thug? Well, you're just nothing but a fucking- Nothing but a what, Montana? No, I could have killed you. I'm getting too old for this shit. Why are you here? Did you run out of options that quickly? Can you please listen to me? I was wrong. About you and about me. I didn't know what I wanted. I think you mentioned that earlier. Can you please listen to me? Like I said, I didn't know what I wanted. But I, uh, I do now. Thought it was just a one-time thing. You know, what you said about me, Terrain, no one's ever talked about me like that before. You heard that? You forgot? I hear everything, baby. And all I want to hear right now is that you want me to. I don't told you we found you, nigga. <laughs> Fucking pussy. The cat's literally out the bag. Shut your bitch ass up. Oh, I thought it was pretty funny. Je uh, Jesse, I swear it wasn't our fault. He flaked. There was nothing we could do. We lost everything. You ain't lose nothing. I lost something. I bet a fast stack on y'all for winning that jazz gala, but clearly I was misinformed of what y'all capable of. You know what? Fuck it. Fuck it. I ain't getting into it. Spades already gave you a pretty good idea of what happens when you piss me off. Got in his head real good. Not much up there, but I think he gets the message. Nah, nah, I don't think he did. You know, Vance, you used to play real good up there. Mommy and Daddy pay for all them fancy saxophone lessons, but you ain't never really had no lessons taught to you. Now you're gonna get one. Lesson one. Never let nobody pour that stupid shit on you. What you did yesterday, Vance? That's pretty fucking stupid. Real fucking stupid. Lesson two. Never let nobody cheat you like no joke. You think I'm a joke, Vance? You see a clown wig under here? Right, right here, don't, right don't, under here. Don't touch me, man. Lesson three. Never, ever let nobody make you step down. Lesson four, no one to let someone else have the fun. <laughs> You're fucked. All right, great way to spend the evening, little Sonny Rollins. How can it get better than that? 96.9, The Wave. I can tell you how it's going to get better than that. We got a little Billy Joel, that's right. And we're going to have Vienna. All right, 96.9. The Wave, check it out. Slow down, you crazy child. You're so ambitious for a juvenile. But then if you're so smart, tell me why are you still so afraid? Mm -hmm. Where's the fire? What's the hurry about? You better cool it off before you burn it out. 
Courage, man. I'll give you that. Hell, even I back down to Milo when it's just me and him. How did you know I would be here? Old habits, I guess. Milo got you pretty bad, huh? Well, cops got him pretty bad, too. Got him on a bunch of charges all the way back from grade school. Is that all you came to tell me? Nah, man. Came to check on you. Rain told me what happened to Dallas. I'm sorry, man. It's probably for the best. She said she was wrong. Wrong? About what? About me. Said she wants a second chance. Hey. You're living every man's dream right now. Then why am I still not happy? What did you tell her? What she wanted to hear. I'm not sure if I wanted to hear it, though. This chick's really messed with your head, huh? I think she just opened my eyes. About Vance, about Milo, even about you, Jonah. Me? You're the only one who's always had my back. No matter how tough shit got, you never backed down. I mean, look at your face right now, man. Ah, uh, it ain't so pretty right now, but every beautiful thing takes time. Well, just look at the way you play bass. That didn't happen overnight. Yeah, and because of me, we didn't get to finish our set last night. Oh, who cares, dude? The rest of us suck. It was a one-man show. Everybody knows that. Montana, none of this is your fault. Look, playing bass for Vance wasn't music. It was torture. Nobody gave you any respect. Not even Alice until it was too late. Yeah, I'll always have your back, man. No matter what. It's just, I don't know what to do with myself anymore. Playing at Maynard was my way of expressing myself. The only way I got respect. Dude, who cares? You don't need those guys. You're better off without them. Look, you got heart, Montana. And that's a rare thing these days. Yeah, and look where that's gotten me. Nowhere. Well, you could be a soulless bastard like Milo, but you're not. You're that little something that everybody wants. Who knows? Maybe it's just luck, or... Maybe you're just a little bit crazy. But... I think it's because you got heart, Montana. And you know what? Life's too short to have no heart. Then I should probably get busy living. Ooh, I bet you wonder how I do. I'm chosen.
Oh, 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 oh.